All right, back here in the city of Toronto, of course, one of the top cities in the world when it comes to restaurants. Yes, you can find just about any kind of cuisine to satisfy your taste buds. Mm -hmm. And now Toronto Life magazine is helping you create some classics in the kitchen thanks to some wonderful chefs right here in the city. Chorizo sausage, pico de gallo salsa, uh, scallions. Those are just a few of the ingredients revealed by top chef David Cherry of Leslieville's Lady Marmalade. We try and just use fresh, local, whole ingredients whenever, whenever we can. Cherry and his partner, Natalia Samachinovich, were asked to participate in Toronto Life magazine's first ever cookbook on newsstands today. Let's make a list of all the best chefs in the city and make a list of all the favorite recipes that we've t uh, tasted there and then go to them and see if they'll give up, um, give up all of their, you know, secrets to us and they, and they did. The issue features 100 recipes from the city's best chefs, bartenders and bakers. And here at Lady Marmalade, the hearty mixture of eggs, sausage, beans and brown rice known as huevos migas is a popular belly pleaser. And done. Toronto is an amazing city with amazing food and to be included as one of the top restaurants and top chefs uh, for David, I think it's a great honor. Another standout food destination in the city is the Harvard Room, where chef Corey Vitaio shares his famous burger recipe. For the meat, we use 100% beef brisket. Um, you know, when you're, there's a couple different kinds of meat you can choose, but you want something with a really good fat content in it. We just condensed it down for, for the cookbook and we gave just the basic meat recipe and, uh, and one of the condiments, the aioli. We Canadians love to cook our burgers on the grill, but to create this juicy work of art, grease is good. It's definitely a fattier, less healthy way of cooking when you're, when you're frying in grease, but it does yield a better result. So the burger that I gave in the cookbook is, is pan fried in a cast iron skillet. And since our chefs were in the mood to spill the beans, we asked them to name some must-have pantry items for the home chef. Top two items would be a chipotle and adobo sauce and black navy beans. Things that we use every day religiously, good dried porcini mushrooms and a good bottle of sherry vinegar. Okay. okay. I'm going shopping. Me too. Okay. <laughs> you're a pretty good cook. I thought you'd had at least some of those items. I, I'm just an okay cook.